and halting the construction of concrete homes and prioritizing the restoration of natural habitat is of utmost importance in order to tackle the challenges faced by migratory birds. Nigerians are strongly encouraged to incorporate conservation and environmental awareness into their development initiatives. And these were the conclusions reached during the 2024 World Migratory Bird Day, which took place at the Nigerian Conservation Foundation, NCF, in Lekki, Lagos. Plus TV correspondent Love Oyedokun tells us more in this report. World Migratory Bird Day raises awareness about conserving migratory birds and their habitats. It educates about threats, ecological, significance and the need for protection. Lagos schools participated in the 2024 event, giving presentations on bird challenges and promoting conservation in Nigeria. Joseph Onoja is the NCF's Director General. He expressed optimism about students' increased knowledge. What we will learn today will serve as probably a pivotal point, especially for the young ones amongst us so that it will spoil you or inspire you to be probably an ornithologist or a conservationist or an environmentalist as the case may be so that you can continue to study this magnificent phenomenon of migration, both of birds, of uh, sea creatures, of insects and so on, and how they play a very important role in our survival. Dr. Sholadoye Iwajomo a senior lecturer from the zoology department of the University of Lagos presented an overview of different bird species that are involved in this annual event to the audience. For many, for many bird species, the best decision is to fly. Fly all the way down to Africa where there is no, so, not so much duration. So these birds come down to Africa every year. And then after they are the winter, they go back to Europe to breed. So they breed in Europe, come down to Africa, spend their winter, so it's like their vacation here in Af Africa. And so when we look at the, I often tell people that, yes, we talk of Jampa syndrome, Jampa syndrome. The Jampa syndrome did not start in Europe. It started long ago in France. Birds have been Jampa from their northern hemisphere. During a chat with reporters at the event, Dr. Stella Egbe, the senior conservation manager of NCF, highlighted the importance of raising awareness about the vital role the natural environment plays in maintaining the ecosystem. We need to restore our, our, our natural spaces. We need to be, um, build conservation and environmental awareness into the developments that we do. Uh, we need to stop building completely concrete homes. Um, we need to plant trees um, that form the foundational basis for the life um, that we enjoy here on Earth. In doing this, we will mitigate the threats that have become very um, challenging within our environment. And then um, uh, nature will begin to restore itself when we, when we make that contribution as humans. The current global campaign for World Migratory Bird Day centers around emphasizing the significance of insects for migratory birds while also drawing attention to the alarming decline in insect populations. Love Oyedoku, Plus TV News.